started with a kick and ended with a wild rollover crash. And tonight, after several months on the run, CHP says they finally caught the motorcyclist accused of starting this chain reaction crash. KCAL 9's Jeff Nguyen is live at the Santa Clarita Valley Sheriff Station with all the details on this arrest. Jeff. Elsa and Peter, Andrew Flanagan walked out of jail here after posting bail in a case in which investigators say they spent months building against him. This is the video that grabbed national attention. The CHP says it was a road rage incident that led to this motorcyclist kicking the side of a Nissan. Then the car swerved towards the center divider of the 14 freeway in Newhall. From there, it bounced back into the flow of traffic and collided with a Cadillac Escalade. We feel that we have the person responsible for this incident. The CHP arrested 45-year-old Andrew Flanagan in Arlita on Tuesday. Investigators believe he was the biker. In fact, they've been telling him for eight months to build a case against him. But they say they were on to him about a week after the chain reaction crash on June 21st of last year. We came to the conclusion that the person certainly most responsible for this was uh, Mr. Flanagan. Hours after the crash, we spoke to Carlos Benavides, the innocent bystander who was driving the Cadillac when it was hit by the Nissan. My truck spun out from beside me and I started to roll. I saw nothing but asphalt and, and sky. The video was captured on cell phone video by a commuter who noticed some back and forth between the motorcyclist and the driver of the Nissan. Flanagan has been booked on three felony charges of assault with a deadly weapon, reckless driving, and hit and run. The CHP says no one else is expected to be arrested for the chain reaction crash. Remember when you're out there that things may happen that may irritate you, that may frustrate you, but ultimately your job to yourself first and to the other motoring, motoring public is to get home safe. And Flanagan posted bail this afternoon, which was set at $110,000 at this point. His first court date has not been set. Peter Nelsa, we'll send it back to you.